Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can get zero ping in Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 7 in a few simple steps. I'm also going to show you a few Windows optimization tweaks you can do and also something you can do outside of Fortnite like getting like certain cables which can also help you to improve your ping and everything like that. And if you enjoy content like this, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me out so, so much. Without any further ado, let's get straight into this topic. And yeah guys, now I'm going to show you in this first step how you can always make sure that your network drivers are up to date. This is super easy. All you guys have to do is go into your Windows search bar and type in manager until you find the device manager just simply open it up and as you can see we got here endless list of our specs here of our PC and all the functions and what we need to focus about is the network adapter section just simply open it up and we can already see here my Realtek gaming controller and this is more or less only because I'm running LAN right now if you're running Wi-Fi it should always say like uh, Wi-Fi behind it as well um, you can actually spot this one here quite easy because it's the only one usually which is like different than the other ones. Then you know that this is your Wi-Fi adapter controller, however you want to call it. And then guys just simply double click onto it and head over into details. And as you can see we've got a new drop down menu here. And what you guys have to do now is simply go into this drop down menu and press F on your keyboard until you find first install date which is right now here. Um, yeah, just simply click on it and it's now going to show you when was the last time you actually updated your network drivers For me, it was the 2nd of April 2021, which is not too long ago um, Which will still be fine But I've literally seen people who haven't updated their network drivers since they bought their PC like let's say like in 2018 or something like that um, Then all you guys have to do is simply go into drivers um, go into update drivers and search automatically for drivers and yeah, if, it's, if it tells you that something uh, has been found, just simply install it. This is all over Windows, nothing can happen. And with that said, we're pretty much done here with the first step, guys. And yeah, guys, now in this next step, I'm going to make sure that you're connected to the nearest and best Fortnite server in your area. And this is super easy, guys. All you have to do is simply go into your Windows search bar and type in network until you find view network connections. Just simply open that one up and it's now gonna show you your main PC internet connection. Uh, for me, it says network because I'm using a LAN cable. If you're using Wi-Fi, it might again say like Wi-Fi or wireless or something like that and then just simply right click onto this and go into property straight up and as you can see this new window here now open up and what we need to take a look for is internet protocol version 4 TCP IPv4 just simply double click onto this and as you can see right now here guys a new list popped up as well and for the first one just uh, leave the check here and obtain IP address automatically but for the second one, for the DNS server guys, use the following DNS server address and for the preferred DNS server just put 8888 and for the alternate DNS server put 8844. This is just gonna make sure that you're connected to the best server in your area. This works for tons of people guys, so many optimization YouTubers already have showed it and this is literally the god strat to get like lower ping you know, and less input delay. And if you've applied everything here correctly, just simply press OK here, press OK, close this here and maybe consider to restart your PC to like, you know, save everything correctly. And yeah, guys, what I also want to mention real quick is that I personally use a D-Line adapter since my router is just way too far from my room. And I already got a whole entire dedicated video where I show everything what this D-Line adapter can do. So I'm just going to leave a link in the description. You can maybe check it out for yourself. This D-Line adapter more or less makes it possible to utilize your power line of your house as a LAN cable, which is like super nice, guys, because a wireless connection just isn't the best, especially not for competitive gaming. So therefore, as mentioned, I'm just going to leave a link in the description and you can maybe check it out for yourself. And now I'm also going to show you a few simple Fortnite in-game settings you can change to gain zero ping or get at least closer to zero ping. And yeah, guys, once we're in-game, all you have to do is simply go into your Fortnite settings and get over here into the game settings. And as you can see right now here, we've got language and region. And what's also super important is for a matchmaking region, please set it directly to the region you're playing on. For me, it's Europe. So I'm just going to put it on Europe. And the issue with setting it on auto might be that Fortnite might maybe select a server which is a little bit closer to you, but with a way worse connection, guys. So I personally would rather have a server which is a little bit farther away or just the best one for me personally, you know what I'm saying guys. So therefore just always put it on exactly the region you're playing on uh, just to ensure that you get the best server possibly available for you. And in combination with all the tweaks we already did before on Windows, you should have now a way better ping than before guys. Just let me know if it worked. And now I'm just going to show you the last final step guys, which is also super important. So see you guys just in a second again on my Windows screen. And yeah guys, now I'm going to show you the best Windows feature literally out there guys. Like this feature is so insanely good. It literally helps you to utilize which program might be maybe causing you to get high ping on Fortnite. And all you guys have to do is go to your Windows search bar and type in resource until you find the resource monitor. I already opened it up because it always takes like a few minutes to properly load up everything 
Uh, and yeah, what you can see pretty much here on this um, tool is super insane guys. If you go over to network, um, it's going to be normally here on overview. Just simply skip here over to network. You can see exactly which programs send as many bits and also receive as many bits. So you can see here that as an example, the search app almost uses like one megabyte um, consistently sending and receiving almost two megabytes. So it has like a high internet activity. I don't know how else to explain it. And yeah, these programs, you just want to make sure to always like look out for these programs which have like a really high value and maybe you can determine which program might be causing your internet to lag or cause you hyping. I currently don't have anything really opened here on my PC. The only thing which I see is here my Logitech Hub. So I'm just gonna right click on it and end the process. And if this program is gone guys, you're just gonna improve your network connection with that, the stability, and you're also gonna get no package loss anymore if you're maybe experiencing some, or you can see right now here even the LG Hub agent, um, wait, which one was it here? The updater one. I'm also gonna end this one. I'm also gonna end this one. This is all um, related to Logitech and always just make sure to look out for any programs which have like an insanely high number guys and with that said we're pretty much done here and this is the final step and yeah guys please also keep in mind that your region is literally the most important part when it comes down to ping you can literally have the best internet in your area you can have the best beefy PC out there ever possibly I don't know everything can be like super high quality you can have the best adapters the best LAN cable whatsoever guys your region is the most important part if in your near is no Fortnite server or the server us are like insanely far away there's just simply nothing you can do there all the tweaks and all the tips i'm showing you in today's video basically just can help to boost it a little bit you know or just to optimize it perfectly so you're like connected to the best server you're having the best connection possibly you can maybe reduce some programs in your background you know remove them which are taking like a huge chunk of your network power but in the end it all comes down to your region more or less i think like yeah this is actually understandable you can't just live in an area where you have like let's say as average like 60 ping do a little bit of tweaking and some changes on your PC and then apparently have zero ping. That's just simply not how it works. You gotta be like really lucky or just as some of these Fortnite players even move countries or whatsever. Like this is crazy bro. Like there's literally out there Fortnite pro players who are moving countries, states, whatsoever just to get zero ping. I just wanted to make sure that you guys know that the most important factor is literally your region and yeah. If you have a high ping and you applied all the steps here correctly in this video and your ping is still pretty high then it's simply coming down to your region and there's nothing you can really do too much. And yeah guys, this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. This would help me out so, so much. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome, I'm out. Peace. Time. All my jello kicks up in the beam and watch us ride